hungry. And we're entering the city of Bhubaneswar that lies just across this bridge. We are sitting over the Khai Nala as is popularly known locally. We are here because of our alert viewers, Saigita Swain and Malvika Nayak, who've written in and told us about lots of exciting places over here. Oh yeah, and old friend Ashutosh, aka Kung Fu Panda, has also called us. And if I do any more of that, I'm going to fall over into the water behind me. Which is not a bad thing. Just in case he falls over, write into us at yummy8ntvgoodtimes.com to come up with the position for anchor. But no, I don't want you to fall down. Bhuvaneswar is a really exciting city. Believe it or not, at one time, Bhuvaneswar had over a thousand temples. In fact, along with Konarak and Puri, it forms this triangle called the Swarna Tribhuja, yeah. the golden triangle for devotees who come to East India to pray. How religious and holy this man is. Look, he has a hole in his head to watch this. <laughs> Excuse me. This is one of the first few planned cities that India has, along with Jamshedpur and Chandigarh. It was designed and developed by a German architect who then went away. Bad move. What do you get if you combine Germans and Indians? I have no idea. My Aryan friend, do you have any idea? Max Buller. <laughs> so on that happy note, with Max Buller, we head into the city of Bhuvaneswar. Here's your Apollo driving tip. Do not stop on a bridge. Yeah, even in case you have something important to do or you got a flat tire, wait till you're at the end of the bridge, then pull over to the side. You must leave bridges empty, so we're going to walk to the end and get a lift. After you, madam. There are many, many hours between breakfast and lunch, and those hours have to be filled meaningfully. And our food has to go into our bellies. So we've come here. This place is called Durga Mandap in Bhuvaneshwar, in a place called Shahid Nagar, where apparently there's lots of snacks and lots of young people. There is a pickle shop in there, and there's a man there who claims that he has pickles that you won't find in any other state in India. Really? Yes. How did he guess that we're in this state? <laughs> we're always in some state or the other, yeah. my friend. And currently our state is desperate and desperately hungry. And I had an uncle who once said that before you start eating, you must eat a little bit. So let's go and eat a little before we get out there and start eating. As you come inside, there's lots of bright colours, lots of funky little things, lots of little knickknacks, paddy wax that you can buy. But most importantly, what drew us first is our noses. And following our nose, we've come here, where things seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Every fruit, every vegetable that you can ever think of. Go on, think of a fruit, think of a vegetable. There's a pickle for it here. Think of a fruit. Ali. Pickle. There's an Ali pickle here at number 14, which seems to be very confusing. Sir, what is Ali pickle? Ali pickle is a big fall. It's a Assam fall. Yes. This is olive oil. Banta hai. Olive. Haan, o -L -I -V -E, olive oil. O-L-I-V-E, not A-L-I-V. If it was A-L-I-V-E, it would have been alive and I would have run away from my hands. Not for very long. <laughs> not after you bit into it, it wouldn't have been alive. Also known as Zaitun in Hindi. This is a delicious olive pickle. Haan, zaitun bhi bolta hai. The recipe is probably the same as a mango pickle. But what's happened is that the olive has become really soft and very, very tangy. We've got many kind of extraordinary pits. We've got an olive pit over here. We've got an arm pit over here. And there's a picture of Brad Pitt over there. And your humour is the pit. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I pity the fool. What do you have to do with your own food? You have to do olive. Ah, olive. And you have to do lishwa. You have to do it. 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 No, we are a Mahila Uddhagga. Okay, so I can try this Mirchi Ola Chaar? Yes, I mean... Which Mirchi Ola Chaar is very good. And who is the most big thing in the Mirchi Ola Chaar? We like the Mirchi Ola Chaar, Mango Ola Chaar. After that, we have to go on our own. 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 Okay. What is this? Mixed pickle. Mixed pickle? Yes. Very lovely. Try the mixed pickle. Do not try this at home. Try this at home though. Mm. Mm, that's nice. That's my favorite so far. Oh, it's sweet. Mostly lemon. Sweet and sour. That's a mixed pickle. Lots and lots of lemon. I can taste it over here. But the chili pickle is brilliant. If you ever come down to this part and to Bhuvneshwar, definitely come down over here because there are lots of fun things around. Lots of young people. And most importantly, some incredibly good pickle. The likes of which I haven't had for a very, very long time, I can tell you. NDTV's Cricket app. Android and iPhone. Faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. 
Download free. NDTV.com slash apps.